in today's video. I'm not going to waste any time because I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So I know that I look a little bit different, but I was so excited to tell you guys about Sundance Now that I just couldn't wait. So I would like to thank Sundance Now for sponsoring today's video. Now, my Dollar Tree still has Valentine's Day decor out. I did pick up Valentine's Day decor, so this will be my last Valentine's Day decor um, haul video. I'm going to try not to edit it, so we'll see how that goes. Um, but anyway, let's just jump right in. Let's not waste any time. So I'm going to start off with the first item that I see. Now, I picked up this XOX. I thought it was really super cute, as is, but I like to take this off and redo it. So that's what I had in mind for this one. Now, I'm just grabbing at random. There's no rhyme or reason to what I'm grabbing at. I love the glow sticks for my kids. I just recently started a TikTok. If you guys are not following me over there, follow me at All Things Crafty too. That is as well as on Instagram. One thing we've been doing is light baths. They're so much fun for the kids. We pick up lights from Dollar Tree. Now, I have found that the best ones are the ones that come in the four pack, and they're a little bit on the thicker side. Um, I'll pop it up on the screen. We just used these the other day, and I pick them up all the time now because they glow the best. And also, we found these new glow balls. They're so cool. They actually do bounce, and they glow really, really good. So they're cool as well. And I'll pop up on the screen here what those look like. But the ones that I have left to show you are the purple eight-piece bracelets. Now, you don't have to use them as bracelets. You can use them just regular. And also the lantern. It looks like a ball. Um, I figured that would be fun for them for another one. And then once you're done the bath, all you have to do is pull them out, dry them off, have the kids help you or do it yourself, stick them in a baggie, stick them in the freezer, and then the next time you have a light bath, you can use them again. Now, I don't really know how long they last doing like that, but I do know that um, we have some in the freezer right now that are still glowing. Moving on to the next item. Oh, here it is, you guys. Here is the ones I was talking about. So these are the best ones that I have found that glow the best, last the longest. Um, you get the best bang for your buck with these. Moving on, these are so cute for gift baskets. Um, I don't do a lot of that stuff on my channel just because so many other people do it. But if you guys want to see my take on gift baskets, let me know in the comments down below. But I thought that these were so super cute. Look, one says be mine. The other one says hearts and hugs. This one's got the cursive um, or I guess the different fonts going on. And then this one is almost like the Ray Dunn font but not not quite if that makes sense but they're both super cute um really good size i figured they'd be perfect for the girls for toys as well um so so many options diys possibilities are endless we well, could put that in um where daddy puts his receipts for mommy yeah. thank you baby you're welcome Okay, moving on. I picked up this waste basket. Now, these are not new to Dollar Tree. However, I needed one. I'm kind of like an in-between right now. I am i don't know where my craft room is. Inside, outside, who knows. But I did need one for my craft area, I guess, inside. So I did pick this up because I love this color. Do love the basket weave on it. Now, it is a little flimsy. It's not on the thickest side, but... It is pretty thick for a dollar. My stores still have not changed over to a dollar twenty-five yet. I do believe they did this week, and we were sick this week, so I haven't been able to check. But at the time when I purchased this, it was still a dollar. But it's still good for a dollar twenty-five. And my state doesn't have sales tax, so my items will only be a dollar twenty-five. All right, again, I'm just gonna grab at random. This was in the Valentine section. Now, of course, I picked these up 
to take the wording off and just use the sign. Now, when I picked these up, they they tricked me, you guys. I thought that this was, like, real. <laughs> I thought that it was real, not real shiplap, but, like, faux shiplap. Um, I didn't realize that it was just literal printed lines on there. But for a dollar or dollar twenty-five, I still feel like that's a really good deal. I picked up the B mine and the XOXO, and I do know that there are other styles. So if I can find that in my footage, I will pop that up on the screen. Okay, moving on to the next item. These are new. I've never seen these before. Um, they're spray bottles, but they're almost like a gray color. Um, and they're smaller in size, so I thought that this would be perfect for, like, my craft cart. Sometimes I just need, like, a spritz of water, um, and this would be really handy to keep next to me. If you guys have never heard of Sundance Now, they are an ad-free streaming service by the AMC Networks that you will not find anywhere else for only $4.99 per month. So I don't know about you guys, but I swear I watch the same shows over and over just on different networks. So it's really refreshing with Sundance Now to watch something much different. So with Sundance Now, there's so many different shows to choose from from around the world and oh my gosh you guys I'm so excited to get into the different ones but there's one or two in particular that I have really been enjoying with my husband especially he's really picky with TV so I know that if he likes these shows they must be really good so one of them is the discovery of witches and you guys I am totally hooked and I know you will too it is about this witch named Diana who did not know that she had special powers until she found this book and then she also came across this gorgeous vampire and don't worry my husband does not get jealous because you guys he is so cute but anyway i love those kinds of shows and this vampire ends up helping her save this ancient book and i know that you guys will love it definitely check it out when you guys sign up. I also love that I can binge watch my shows from anywhere I want, even in the school pickup line, because you can download the app. Also, you can stream from any device like Apple, Roku, Google Chrome, Amazon Fire TV, and many more. And I also love having so many choices to choose from. Like original prestige dramas, international thrillers, and bone-chilling true crime shows, just to name a few. I have to be honest though, you guys, I do love a little dark drama, so I have been loving watching The Divide, where the top 0.1% earn as much as the bottom 90%, and it's a story of all these people just wanting a better life, and I can relate to that. I guess that's why I was drawn to this show, and I just love it so much. I'm so hooked, and I cannot put it down. It's especially amazing to watch on my crafting days when I'm in my craft room, and I really need some Something just to pop on in the background. Watching Sundance now has been so much fun and now it can be so much fun for you as well or else I wouldn't be here with a offer for you guys. So if you guys want to try Sundance now free for 30 days check the link in the description box as well as go to sundancenow.com and type in all things crafty at checkout. That's sundancenow.com. Type in all things crafty at checkout and thank you so much for Sundance Now for sponsoring today's video. I also picked up another one of these jars. Now I do believe I hold that I hauled this last time and I used several of the ones that I picked up, so I did just pick up another one of those. And I also picked up, now I've never really been in a napkins before, but I've seen people do so many different things with them, so this I also used in my previous DIY haul video, um, but I didn't show you in that haul because I had gotten them after the fact, but look how cute these napkins are. Um, I just love both the patterns on them. Let me flip this one around. So this one has like the faux wood shiplap look with like a piece of jute and a hanging heart that says XOX, XOXO. And then this one is kind of like a pink shiplap 
with a bunch of balloon hearts. And this one is my favorite. I do think I have another pack of napkins, but I don't see them right this second, so. Oh, I should have showed you guys this way. Duh, Melissa. Next, for some signs. I've never seen these at my store. I thought they were so pretty with the wood and the like the wood look in the back. I do love this banner, but I could see myself maybe cutting a piece of foam board or a piece of something and putting that over it because this is glitter. Or you could sand it smooth, but I didn't want to mess up this or I wouldn't want to mess up this wood, this faux wood. It looks so realistic. It's even got faux screws in it. It looks so real. Like, I thought that it was real until I picked it up. Moving on to the next sign I picked up. This is another new one. I always, or I usually pick up the ones that I haven't seen. Just so that way if I do want to show you guys, I can show you guys. But look how cute. This would be perfect on a wreath or um, even just by itself, like hanging on your front door or something. Super, super cute, especially for less than $2. Okay, here's that another. Here is the other pack of napkins that I found. It's got a pink border and then it's got a pink heart with XOXO. It's also got a bit like an ombre effect or I don't know what you want to call that, but it's different colors. I love those colors, the pink and the purple and kind of like the orange. I think they all go together so well and I think these are so pretty. Okay, so along the lines of like napkins, paper, they sell, what is this? brand. I know it, I just can't think of it off the top of my head. What is the card? Hallmark? I'm pretty sure these are Hallmark papers. Did I? I don't know if I got these from Dollar Tree. Somebody let me know in the comments, but oh no, these are from Dollar Tree. These are from Dollar Tree. I picked up two packs of the gift tissue um, for Valentine's Day. So since school, I always try to take care of her teachers. So anytime I pick or anytime I see stuff like this, I pick it up with that kind of stuff in mind. Okay, moving on. Look how cute this tin is, you guys. So I know that gnomes are like so many people's things. And I have to say that I never really got into the gnome thing. I don't know why. Like, I think they're cute and everything, but I just guess I don't understand the obsession but I do think these are so cute like there were several to choose from and the this was the one I chose because it's just so super cute I'm a sucker for anything with like pink and hearts and stuff like that and this one was really really like that so I guess that's why it drew me to it but it says to know you is to love you look how cute that is and then the sides say it as well. And they're like kissing each other. Oh my goodness. So, so, so stinking cute. Sorry guys, I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> I don't, I never noticed I did that until my husband pointed it out, but if I don't have my glasses on, I'll like squint so I can see. But the glare on my glasses drives me nuts and I need a new pair because my face is too skinny now so nothing is helping. So I only wear them when I like absolutely need them. But anyway, look at these. Okay, this, this really impressed me. Okay, this impressed me. And whoever said in the comments that Dollar Tree doesn't pay attention to us, they surely do because there's a section on Dollar Tree's website where you can add your crafts and then they put it on the page. Like, let's just say I'm shopping on DollarTree.com, right? So I'm looking at these signs. Well, if there's a creator who DIY'd something with these, you can 
upload it to the Dollar Tree website and then Dollar Tree will show your video and your project to that item on their website if that makes sense. So whoever said that Dollar Tree doesn't pay attention they sure do but anyway you guys seriously when I saw these I could not get over it because look how big they are. <gasps> are you kidding me right now? Seriously. You guys, they're really heavy too. Really good quality. Look how cute his little hat is with the sequins. If you guys are into ASMR. <laughs> but yeah, look at him. He's got the white beard and the red outfit. Then you have the white white <laughs> white outfit with the red um, heart polka dots. And then lastly, I don't know if there's any more, but um, I guess she is the opposite of him because she's got little piggy tails. I just cannot like as a set okay bear okay stay with me stay with me okay you know you have a friend that like loves gnomes right okay how cute would this be for just a because gift I really love to give just because gifts instead of like for holidays and stuff how cute would this be for a just because like really you guys look how cute that is if I love gnomes as much as a lot of people do and my friend gave this to me you guys this cost five dollars I would be so over the moon grateful so look how cute. Anyway, all right, I'm sorry. I know we just went on and on about gnomes. I'm sorry, but I was just really, really, really impressed with the quality of those. And it feels really heavy. So when you give the gift, I don't know about you, but like the heavier something feels, the more expensive it feels. I don't know why, but that's just a thing. Let me know in the comments down below if you feel the same way or is it just me? I don't know. Anyway, this is a repeat item, but if you see these, pick them up, you guys. These twist off super easy. I'm not going to do it right now, but these twist off super easy. You can remove it, add something else. You can cut it off completely and make this into a sign. There's so many different options for these, so I did pick up two more while I saw them. And then I also picked up these. These are the exact same thing. These tag signs for a dollar, two of them. You guys, they're really, really good size. Not quite small enough for a tiered tray, but not quite big enough for like a front door sign. But this is perfect for like those awkward places that you're like, that's a really awkward size. I don't really know what to put there. That would be perfect to do up a sign and put in like an awkward spot. Okay, moving on. Look at these, you guys really for a dollar these you don't need to do anything with make one of those beautiful wreaths and then pop this off of the stake and attach it right to the middle how cute would that be or you could pop this off the stake flip it over do up this side in a sign and then you have a double-sided sign. Or, like I said, leave them as is and stick them down your lane. That would be so cute for Valentine's Day. I don't usually do big for Valentine's Day, but I do know many people that do. So if you're one of them, these are perfect for you. Okay, these are cute little craft kits. I've never seen them before. DIY craft kit. I picked them up for Sophia. So as soon as I'm done, I'll give them to her. And then maybe I'll take a little video of her doing them. But she's like me, you guys. She loves arts and crafts. She loves to do stuff with her hands. Um, and I also thought these would be cute to give as like a little after school activity. 
um, when they get home from school and do their homework. There's always that time where you just need a little something to keep them occupied before bed. These are perfect for that. Comments down below. Would it be helpful for you guys to see the items like on my counter? I know some people do that where they kind of like put it up against like a white background so you guys can see the items better. Let me know in the comments down below if that's something that you guys would benefit from or do you like that I just go through the items? I don't know. Anyway, moving on are these little heart candle holders decor. I don't know what you want to call it, but I picked up all three of the colors that I saw. I do believe that these are a repeat item from last year. Um, that's another thing you can let me know in the comments. I do believe I remember seeing these from last year, but don't quote me. I can't remember what happened two seconds ago, let alone last year. <laughs> so I'm probably not the best person to ask things like that. Moving on. Now, last time I hauled, last time I did a Valentine's Day haul um, last week, I did show you guys that these were on the shelf and at the time I didn't pick them up because I wasn't too sure what I was going to do with them, but I forgot that Chalk Couture has heart cutouts as well as the transfers that go along with them, so I figured that these would be perfect to use instead of purchasing the Chalk Couture um, cutouts, I could try using these with the heart transfer. So. I picked up the Cutie Pie and the Be Mine. I just picked up um, what they had. These were the last two that they had, so I picked both up. Next item is this Heart Ribbon Lace. Again, I've never seen this before. I thought it was so cute. Um, this is the same. This is the same pattern. Oh, here's the other one. Okay, I knew I grabbed both. All right. There is the one pattern. And then here is the second pattern. I thought these would be so cute for pillows. I don't know. There's so many things that you could use these for. Um, if you guys hear my kids, they're here. Again, I'm a mom. They've been home for weeks. It's a long story. Anyway, if you hear them, they're here. Sorry, not sorry is what it is anyway um i thought that for sure i could make something really cute for their new room at the new house okay you guys now i have searched high and low for these everybody saw the beads the long long bead strands i never saw them at my store so everybody always thinks my stores are amazing i never see all these amazing items that many people see so don't think that mine is any like better but also if you guys want to learn the tricks to shopping the good dollar trees just let me know i can do a video on that um i know a lot of people are doing like hacks and like stuff like that and unfortunately here on youtube like even if you don't want to do certain things in order for you to grow and have success you kind of have to so, I don't know, I thought that would be kind of a good starting point to trying to do more fun things because I personally do think that would be really fun to do hacks. You guys, I have so many, like, hacks, so let me know in the comments. I know I always say that, but I always have so many questions for you guys. I don't know, so anyway. I searched high and low. I finally found these. Somebody had like tucked them. Anyway, always look behind the shelves. Look behind stuff because people hide stuff. Why? It's only a dollar, but I mean, I get it. You know, maybe you just might not have enough and you decided you wanted a different item that day, but you wanted to come back for it and I get it, but I mean, I found it. Sorry. <laughs> I was looking high and low, you guys. High and low. And I'm not the best looker either. My husband is the one who, if I lose something, he finds it. Because I just scan. I don't look very good. I just scan and then I go, I don't know. So anyway, always look in places you might not expect to find things. Okay, moving on, you guys. 
always check their clothes section. Look at these tank tops I found for a dollar. So now this one is large. Um, I'm like a small now, but I will use this in the summertime for like cleaning and stuff, just for like a nasty shirt or even just to keep and do something for Chalk Couture as a gift or again, there's so many possibilities. I don't know how to hold this. Hello! <laughs> Um, so many different possibilities, and they are good quality. This is Anvil. I forget what where that comes from, but I do know that it's a good brand. Good quality. They're really soft and lightweight. It's perfect for summertime. Here's another one. So I picked up two of these. Um, these are the Gildan, Gildan, however you want to say it, women's tank top. It is a small so I picked up two smalls, again, um, chalk couture in mind, or just to have as a shirt. They're super cute. I love just plain workout clothes for summer. That's my go-to. So picked up two of those. Actually, I picked up three of those. Um, and then last but not least, I picked up a medium in black, the same thing. So this is what the shirt looks like. I know I didn't hold it up very good, but for a dollar, you cannot beat that. Okay, you guys, if you're still here, I love you so much. We're, we're getting down to the nitty gritty, don't worry. You guys, look at these jars. I know I've seen plenty of people haul these before. I've never seen them at my store, but I knew that the second I picked them up, these would be perfect for Bath and Body Works um, candle holder dupes. These are perfect. So the last time I used a jar from Target Dollar Spot, um, but that was $3. This is only a dollar and it's really comparable in size. You can fit probably a good few little pieces of decor in there. Close it up, put something on the top, put your candle on top. So cute. So there's the bottom, there is the top, it is like a galvanized, or yeah, galvanized. These would be also super cute as like canisters on your countertop or in your bathroom. Um, I'm going to be in a new home, so I have so many good ideas for all the different spots. I'm so excited. But anyway, I picked up two of those. Okay, now, I don't... I don't know if I showed you guys these in my last haul. I don't think I did. But look at these signs they have. They have a frame around them. And you literally don't have to do anything to the frame. Pop it off. Either sand this down. Or flip it over. And um, this one doesn't even have a sticker. So flip it over. Paint it. Do whatever you like. Take the frame from the front. Put it on the back boom, you have a high-end sign that probably took just a couple minutes. And then the other one was Heart and Hugs. So even that would be like a really super cute gift. Same font, same, same everything. So here is those two signs side by side. Even these would be super cute in like a little girl's room as like a set. Huh. That might have just given me a really good idea. So yeah, I thought those were really, really cute. Again, I love the frame. I picked up five of those. I'll go through those in no time. You guys know I love my signs. Um, so speaking of signs, now I do have these, but I did want to pick them up um, just to have inside. I've kind of been 
buying a little bit of things to keep inside and a little bit of things to keep outside in my shed because if you guys have been around for any amount of time then you know that I have a she shed and prior to that I was crafting inside well when I bought my she shed we did a little space for the kids Isabella was old or young enough to be in like a Johnny jumper or something like that um, so it worked. Well, now Isabella is almost 18 months old. Sophia is almost six and they cannot be bothered by being contained. So I'm at a, I'm at a stage in life where I need my craft space in the house. Um, it's just much easier with the kids and everything else. So that's where I'm at. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, look how cute these are. So all that to say, I've been trying to buy just like a few things to keep inside. That way I don't have to keep bringing in and out, in and out, because that drives me nuts. But anyway, look how cute these shiplap hearts are. Moving on are these cute little teeny envelopes. Look how cute they are. My friend Liz from Liz Decal and Decor. If you guys are not subscribed to her, go check her out, you guys. She's amazing. Her style is amazing. I love her DIYs. I love the way she does her videos. Um, but she just did a DIY with those. When I saw them, I was like, I don't know what in the world I'm going to do with this. But she did a super cute DIY with them. So definitely go over to check her out. Next, I picked up these little wands for my girls. Look how cute. <gasps> At Dollar Tree. Like, seriously? For a dollar. Aren't they so cute? This is why I love having little girls because this kind of stuff like just makes me <laughs> just makes me so happy. I don't know why. I just love girly pink flower floral. I just love all the pinky girly colors. Last but not least for Dollar Tree, I do have a few items from Walmart that I want to show you guys just because I just randomly picked them up but um are these socks look at the little gnomes okay so wait a minute okay I did not do this on purpose but you have a best friend she loves gnomes and you love her as much as she loves gnomes so come on She'll love you forever. Okay? <gasps> She'll love you forever. Okay? I promise. He's got little hearts in his hand. He's so cute. And then you've also got... I've never seen fuzzy socks like this at Dollar Tree. Maybe I'm just crazy, but they're low-cut. They say low-cut socks and they're fuzzy they have um cupcakes on them with little hearts so i thought they were super cute too so i picked them up now moving on to the walmart items again i just figured i'd show them to you because they are valentine's day related and this is going to be my last haul video so why not right so the first one is Valentine's Day kitchen towels. These are like the conversation hearts on the front. Or I should say the first towel. They have, they say all the sayings. Kiss me, sweet, cutie, XOXO, be mine, blah, blah, blah. And then if you flip it around, it is just plain hearts. So the second towel is just plain hearts. Really, look how cute. And then the next set, now this one I really like because it's neutral colored. It's not all those bright colors. Um, the first one says XOXO, and then the other one is just uh, black and white stripes. How cute is that? Oh, 
okay? And then the last item I have for you guys, probably the best item that you guys will love. You guys, if, if you guys saw my shorts, if you're not seeing my shorts, definitely make sure your notification bell is on. I upload my TikToks that I, I upload my videos that I put on TikTok to in or to YouTube Shorts as well as Instagram. I just speed them up a little bit, so always look out for that. But. I showed this there. I did not show it on my channel, so I figured that I would show you how cute this is. It's the Valentine's Day tiered tray. It's got a little heart at the top. It was super easy to put together. It came with directions. It was only 10 bucks. Okay, friends, that was it for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. We are a little under the weather over here, but thankfully, you guys, that I'm not going to name that word, what we got. You know, with Soph being in school, I figured that she would bring it home, but I'm not going to name that word. But we, it was literally only a 24 hour bug for us, which I'm super grateful for. Leave me your CV stories down in the comments. I'm always curious to see like how it has affected different people because I do know that it does affect everybody very, very differently. And just know that I am with you guys no matter what. I love you guys so, so much. If nobody has told you today, you are absolutely amazing and stunning. You are worthy, and I love you with all my heart and soul. And you guys know I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.